Hi, Dr. Lara here. I hope you're doing well today. So I set off on my soul walk today asking for guidance, and they told me that the post-it that I'm going to post has to do with the message that they wanted to give you today. So the message says something about goals and it taking forever to reach your goals, but the goals aren't the important thing. It's being in the moment that lead up to the goals. And it was funny because I was like, oh, I know what I'm going to say on that. And then I went for my soul walk. It's like, no, you're not going to say that, which is really interesting because it ties into the message that I got today, moving from ego to spirit. Because when we're an ego, we always want to know what we're going to say, what we're going to do, how it's going to happen. And then when we move from spirit, we're uh, freer to be in the moment and not have to know everything. So the message today was about goals. And what happens when we anticipate our goals or when we get frustrated because we're not where we want to be? And what they showed me was this is conditioned from when we were kids. So when you're little, you're looking toward you're looking forward towards a holiday. You're looking forward towards your birthday. You're looking forward towards something that's going to be fun. And you have that excitement and it because you want to be there. Okay, because you know that when you get there, it's going to bring you joy. So you get there and there's joy and that's what we're conditioned to do is to constantly look towards the future, look towards something for us to feel that joy. But what happens when we get older, because we have that same conditioning, we're looking towards a goal because we think that when we reach that goal, it's going to make us feel better. But as we get older, things don't always work out the way we think they should or in the time frame that we think they should. Because when you're a kid, you know, like if you celebrate Christmas, it's going to come on that day. If when you're a kid and you uh, want to sell your birthday, you know it's going to come on that day. You know it's going to come. But as we get older with our goals, you know, we set a date and it doesn't always happen on that date and it doesn't always happen the way we expect it to or want it to and then we get frustrated because why isn't this happening but the underlining thing it's not about the success of the goal it's not about the accomplishment it's about wanting to feel that joy that excitement that that um, happiness that you think that that goal is going to bring but if we're always in that moment looking, or we're always looking for that moment, we're not here in the present and we miss everything that's in front of us. And that's why it says on that note that the goal isn't as important as the journey it took to get there. So if we can learn to move from ego to spirit, so ego wants to know when it's gonna happen, how it's gonna happen, to spirit, knowing that it's going to happen at the pace and the time that it's going to happen and we're okay with that, then we can be more in our body. We can be more in the present moment and we can experience the joy that's in front of us here today. Because if we're always looking forward towards the future to feel that joy, we miss it. We miss the here and now. So today I invite you to move from ego to spirit because that's what we're doing. That's what this whole awakening process is. It's teaching us how to let go of our humanness and to get into our soul, to get into our spiritual essence. And we already know how to do this. We're just being reminded and we're remembering how to be in the moment, how to find the joy in the day. The goal is going to happen the way it's going to happen, no matter what, right? But we don't want to lose the gift that we have in this present moment. So I hope that helps. And also, um, I did a free gift. I know it was a PDF before, but this one, it's, an, it's a 20-minute angel meditation. So if you want that, go and click on the link. It'll take you to my website, and then you'll get to download a 20-minute meditation that was guided with the angels. It's my favorite one, and I want to give that as a gift to you because you know what? We need to share who we are. We need to help one another and be who we are, shine our light. So anyway, I hope you have a beautiful, beautiful, 
wonderful day. Thanks so much for listening.